My name is Jeannie Dixon, and I'm a watercolor and lettering artist. I'm the author of the book Hello Watercolor and the artist behind Jeannie Dixon Designs. I have been painting for some time now, and I have tried different brands of watercolor paints, but today I'm excited to introduce you to my Jeannie Dixon My Mary Blue watercolor set. My Mary Blue features 90 brilliant single pigment colors. As you can imagine, it was extremely difficult to select a limited color palette. Through a careful selection process, I narrowed it down to my top six favorite colors. These are Quinacridone Violet Reddish, Turquoise Green, Yellow Ochre, Yellow Vanadium, Orange Lake, and Primary Red Magenta. My Mary Blue Superior Watercolors is a professional grade brand that features an absolute purity of pigments that together with glycerin and gum arabic compose the totality of the mixture. My Mary Blue uses all natural gum arabic from Sudan which is known for having the best quality gum arabic in the world. Here we are taking a closer look at each of the colors that come in the set. When purchasing new paints, it's important to take note of certain information such as the color name, pigment number, light fastness, opacity or transparency, or whether a pigment is staining or non-staining. The reason I love these watercolor paints is because of their transparency and the freshness of the washes they produce. These are two things that are extremely important to me as a watercolor artist. For this set, I chose six colors that were not only highly pigmented and looked beautiful on their own, but that also had the ability to intermix to create a greater range of colors. Quinacridone Violet Reddish, PV55. This is my absolute favorite color that I use all the time. This is a transparent pigment that can be bold when used in a thick consistency or delicate when heavily diluted. Turquoise Green PB16 This is a beautiful transparent pigment that varies a little from more blue to mid turquoise. Yellow Ochre PY42 this is an opaque pigment that can be used alone or you can mix it with all the other colors in the set to create a more earthy, muted color palette. Vanadium Yellow PY184 This is a semi-opaque pigment that produces a bright and vivid yellow, perfect for any floral piece. Orange Lake PO43 this is a cooler orange that features a transparent pigment that is bold and bright. Primary Red Magenta PV19 This is a cooler red that can easily be mixed with either blue or yellow to create some other beautiful secondary colors. Using the colors in this set, you can easily create a rainbow-like gradient. Having a limited color palette doesn't mean that you have limited colors. Here I'm showing you some of the different combinations I created by mixing two different colors from the set. I recommend you create a chart like this for each color combination and swatch it out in at least three different values. These are so much fun to make and it's the best way to get acquainted with your new paints. If you're wondering how you can create different types of greens and browns that are not included in the set, let me give you a quick demonstration.
Look at this beautiful shade of green. I'm sure you can come up with so many other combinations. Here are just a few of the beautiful greens I was able to create very quickly. Using turquoise green and orange lake, I'm quickly creating different types of browns. You can make it warmer or cooler by adjusting the paint ratios. You can also create brown by mixing quinacridone violet reddish and yellow ochre. Look how rich and creamy these paints are. In case you're wondering, I'm swatching these paints on Saunders Waterford 140 pound cold press watercolor paper and I'm using my Princeton Summit size 8 round brush. Now that I've had fun swatching all of my colors, I'm going to label each mix to remember what colors I used. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy using the colors in this set. They are my favorite colors and I hope they become your favorite colors too. Happy painting!